Oh, Reen, you made it. Hey, Elliot, you're looking kind of nervous. Is it that easy to tell? There are quite a few people here, so I can't really help it. Especially since I'm the lead violinist now because of Highbell's accident. I can totally understand why you're nervous then. Good luck. Thanks. You'd probably be glad if I stayed. Yes. There's still some time left before you're on, right? Let's chat a little before then. It might help calm your nerves. Mm -hmm. Thanks, Reen. I'd really appreciate it. Elliot started using, or started using, tuning his violin before the performance began. That should do it. All that's left now is to wait until it starts. Not long now. You're looking pretty confident, though. Hmm? Well, I mean, I can tell you're nervous, but... You look focused. Like you've just had a big distraction taken off your mind. Hmm, you're probably right. And I think that's thanks to last month's field study. Now that you mention it, a lot of good things happened to me while we were back in Heimdall. I got to meet my friends who ended up attending the music academy and I got to talk to you all about everything. I finally have the confidence I needed to stop running from my love of music. But I never would have gained that confidence if it weren't for all of you. Hm. You really are tough, aren't you? Good luck out there, Elliot. I'll be cheering you on with the rest of the audience. Just you wait. You're going to put on the kind of show you'll tell your grandkids about. And so began the Wind Orchestra's performance. Elliot and the rest of the wind orchestra played passionately, pouring all they had into every note. That pa I can't talk. That passion captured the hearts of all who were present, and their performance was deemed a resounding success. Your bond with Elliot strengthened. Ooh, Link level four. 